There was nothing about the starry sky that night to suggest that strange and mysterious things would soon be happening. Hagrid, at last. And where did you get that motorbike? Borrowed it, Professor Dumbledore, sir. No problems, were there? No, sir. House was almost destroyed, but I got him out all right. Nestled in the bundle was a baby. Harry Potter, the boy who lived. For the next 11 years, Harry lived with his dreadful Aunt Petunia, Uncle Vernon, and cousin Dudley, the Dursleys. Then, one day, he received a letter inviting him to attend Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. You can just see how excited he is. Right then, we're finally starting the PS2 version of Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. And for those of you who are thinking, where is that? It's called Sorcerer's Stone. Let me get this straight, because I've been asked this loads of times, so I'm just going to clear it up. Everywhere in the world, it's called Philosopher's Stone. Apart from the USA, where it's called Sorcerer's Stone. I don't know why. Probably check it to Google, and it will say that. But I can't bother to do that right now. Let's sort of do the walkthrough. Uh, it's probably my least favourite game next to Goblet of Fire because it's basically a rip-off of a uh, Chamber of Secrets, which is quite annoying. That's the way of ripping off Harry Potter fans, in my opinion, for the sixth generation consoles. Told you, didn't I, Harry? Told you you was famous. No, you didn't. Professor Quirrell. I just walked for the story. Harry, Professor Quirrell will be one of your teachers at Hogwarts. Oh, no. Can't be a good sign. Man in a turban. Potter, can't tell you how pleased Bold I am. in his head, Harry. Bold in his head. Beware. What sort of magic do you teach, Professor Quirrell? D -d Defence against the dark arts. He sort of shouts that, doesn't he? <laughs> Not that you need it, eh, Potter? You'll be getting all your equipment, I suppose. I've got to pick up a new book on vampires myself. Must get on, lots to buy. Come on, Harry. So a giant person and a bean equivalent. Right, this school seems very strange Up already. To across. Right, stand back, Harry. Wow, who'd have guessed? The bricks are moving. Welcome to Diagon Alley. So that's where they keep all the drugs. Just your wand left from Ollivander's. Oh yeah, and I still haven't got your birthday present. So we're now left to go to a stranger's shop. Hello? Good call, Hagrid. Good afternoon. Ah, yes. Herb alert. Yes, yes. I thought I'd be seeing you soon, Harry Potter. You have your mother's eye. Yes, in my pocket. It seems only yesterday she was in here herself. Buying her first wand, ten and a quarter inches long, swishy, made of willow. Nice wand for charm. You can tell he doesn't get out father, much. <laughs> on the other hand, favoured a mahogany wand. Well, I was like, what the hell are you on about? It. It's really the wand that chooses the wizard, of course. I just want the well, wand. Now, Mr. Potter, let's get started, shall we? If you'll kindly follow me. Have a look around, Mr. Potter. When you find a wand you like, pick it up, and let's see if it likes you. Ooh, mystical now. Wee, fly around. So yeah, this walkthrough is for the PS2, but it's practically the same as the uh, GameCube and the Xbox version, apart from the controls. So our first task, let your wand choose you. Well, surely that means I can stand here and just wait for it to happen. But no! I've got to go and pick the right one up. So far we have the Folio Magi for our books, which is basically the first version, I suppose, of the Folio Universitas. For those of you who have watched my Prisoner of Azkaban walkthrough. There's a completely Tars and Hints book, which we should not go in again. And the same goes for school records. Well, maybe the end of the game then. <laughs> But now, let us choose our wand, and we can't search these bookshelves for stuff. We'll probably start doing that a lot. Ebony and Unicorn hair. 
Eight and a half inches. Springy. Ooh. Sounds nice. Stand over there, on that platform, to try your wand. He really does talk it up, considering it's a piece of wood. And where do these books on the floor come from? But anyway, let's now try the wand. The square, triangle, circle, and let's see what we get. The cat failed. My goodness. Definitely not. I swear some books flew into the air, but they didn't come back to town. Okay, and now the wand's going round and round again. We must take our pick. I'll show you the two incorrect ones before I show you the correct one. Phoenix feather. That's the correct Eleven one. Eleven inches. The correct one. The correct nice one. And supple. What's this one then? You won't say. Holly and Phoenix feather. Yeah, it's not what that one is. Ebony and unicorn hair. Done that already. Eight and a half inches. Oh, this one then. Springy. You got to test what it is? No, of course not. I think it's. Something like Beechwood and Dragon Heart String. So let's give it a try and see what we get. No, definitely fail. not. Well, I can't bother now to do the other ones again because it does fail. But um, I find when I go past the correct one, my controller vibrates, and also when you pick it up, there'll be a light on the end of the wand. So that should help you out a bit. Look at the base though, absolutely. Holly and it. feather. Here we go. Eleven inches. Nice and supple. Way. And now let's try the one. Hopefully, hopefully, it might just work. Yes, heroic moment when nothing happens. It's a lightning the wand. Yes, Harry, you're a hero now. And now even more cutscenes. I swear, like, man, like a minute of gameplay in this walkthrough so far. Curious. How very curious. Let's all stories. <laughs> all had before. Sorry, but what's curious? I remember every wand I've ever sold, Mr. Potter. Basically, every single wand. that one gave you the scar. It so oh, happens okay, that the phoenix, <laughs> whose tail feather is in your wand. Gave another. Shows feather. what I know. <laughs> My Just bad. one other. Oh, it is very curious indeed that you should be destined for this one when it's brother. Long pause for no reason. Why its brother gave you that scar? That's what I meant to say. <laughs> curious indeed how these things happen. The wand chooses the wizard, remember? I think we must expect great things from you, Mr. Potter. Ooh. After all, he who must not be named did great things. Oh, yes. Terrible. Yes. But great. Well, I got the wand, now you can leave, right? Please retrieve the spell book that oh, lies beyond. It will prove most valuable in all that lies ahead. So we come to a shop to get a wand, and we then get to try this stupid assault course that we've got to do, which, for anyone who's played these sort of games before, over here, Mr. Potter. already know anyway. Oh well. Gain the Fependo Spellbook. This basically teaches you how to play the game, you know, like all the controls, that sort of thing. There's our pause menu so you can look at that in all its glory. How we can move along narrow ledges and through narrow gaps. Cause he's awesome. There's mm. a lot of beans! Toast. Yay! Mm. Let's again. Spinach flavor! Oh, sorry, got cold. <laughs> Vomit flavor! And sometimes, quite amusing, but other times, annoyingly, he yells out every flavor of the bean that he eats or consumes or whatever. Okay, you can line up the camera with the screen like this. I'm pressing L1, quite useful. Tripe. I could jump mm. down there now. Coffee. That's one Fish. done. So that goes against health and safety. And where to get this room anyway, for this? But I'm gonna jump down Over now. Here, Mr. Potter. Don't worry, there is bad for us to get back out. But there are some beams down here that I can get. Because like in the last game we must collect beams. Mm. Chocolate to spend in Fred and George's shop at Hogwarts. 
and the crazy thing is, they all look mm. really young, mm. chocolate, including all the students. And President George and Percy seem to be the only older students. Everyone else was like first years. It's like, okay, right, there's no other beans here. The ladder, and that pre climb. One of Harry's super moves, climbing ladders. And that's it for now.